I'm Eric Singer, Gazette.com, here at the City Administration Building, just outside of it, off of Nevada and Colorado. Joining me is among the many people who are going to be taking your ballot. This is Kenneth. Thank you, Kenneth. And this is Christy. Let's go with ladies first. All right. So, Christy, so far I've seen a steady stream of folks. Tell me about that. We sure have. We started at 7 this morning, and we've had a ste steady stream, especially just before 8 o'clock, before the workers were off to work. And um, it's been continuous all throughout the day. Beautiful day to be voting. Have you had the opportunity to chat with some people going, wait a second, why did it wait? So why did you wait so long? You know, I actually haven't. Um, we've just been greeting them, accepting their, their ballots, and um, wishing them a, a great day. Everyone's been happy, and um, it's worked out nicely for them, especially about dropping off the ballots. It's been an easy task for them rather than having to step into an office. So, All right, well, I'm going to talk with Kenneth for just a moment because, Kenneth, this is pretty exciting. You are a high schooler who is now part of this whole process. Let's talk about that. Yes, sir. Uh, I'm currently a high school student at Colorado Springs Early Colleges. I'm dual enrolled at Pikes Peak Community College. So um, one of my teachers at CSEC uh, asked me to come out here and participate. So I thought it was a great opportunity. And speaking of that great opportunity, how does it make you feel to be part of this process? Well, I think, uh, I think democratic government is a great thing. And any way to be a part of it is amazing, especially at my age. Absolutely, and thank you so much, and thank you both for doing this. And there are more people out here who are also accepting your ballots. And remember, this is among the many multiple locations throughout Colorado Springs, so you can drop off your ballot today. And remember, you have until 7 o'clock to do that. And remember, go to gazette.com for your full elections update after 7 o'clock. And before then, if you're still deciding on your ballot, well, hey, we've got all the information for you on gazette.com. Reporting live, Eric Singer, gazette.com.